Hive Ones Rush Clan, and yes, I have got an Alakazam EX deck that will actually beat a lot of decks in ranked, and you could use it at your locals and stuff like that. It's a really fun deck, and it's really, it's, I mean, I'm not a big fan of stalls, but being able to stall and attack, that's fine with me. As long as I can attack, I'm happy. Uh, with Mind Jack, uh, Dimensional Hands is so cool. And you can even finish off the match with Mind Jack as well. We are using the Power Line with Mini Q to shut down at most of the meta. Uh, Cleffa, which shuts down like Greninjas and stuff like that. Jirachi, in case they knock it out, we get three extra cards of our choice, which is amazing. Uh, Manaphy to protect us against that Greninja and the Chimpel matches. Uh, Arvins, Ionas, Judges. Here is really disruption, disruption, disruption. De evolution, really good. Neo up energy, so that's the ice spec of the day. Uh, Neo up energy, we could just attach it straight to Alex Sam, start attacking. This deck is disgusting and it's really, really fun. And it can beat lots of decks. Spoiler alert, just hard. And <coughs> Arceus. Uh, anyway, so I'll see you in the next part. See you. Right, so Alex Sam. And it's it's kind of a stall. Alakazam attack and stall. It's the same thing. Um, so I wouldn't have. I didn't really want this this Abra here. Uh, so I'm gonna have to go for like. Um, let's see. Oh, it's a Greninja. I like the sleeves. Where did you get them? Comment down below if you know a way to get them sleeves because they're awesome. What does it say at the bottom? Not too sure. But I like them sleeves. They are some really nice sleeves. Anywho, Abra. And Alakazam, of course. Um, it could do 120 from the bench. Or if your opponent's got five Pokemon on the bench, 240 damage. Um, which is enough to knock out an Iron Hand, which is really good. Now... There is a Greninja there. I am a bit worried about the Greninja. And then I can go... What we got? We got one energy, two energy. We need that. And we're going to need... Buddy Puffin. And then we can search the deck. No Bidoofs. All my Bidoofs are prized. Are you serious? That's ridiculous. Right. And then I'm going to attach for you. Attach you. Evolution. One, two. And there is two, so that's great. Because we do play plenty. Uh, so we've got two Alakazams without the rare candy. Um, let's see what we get here. Because I don't know what I'm playing against yet. I don't know. It's, oh, oh, it could be a... Ah, it could be a Lone and Vulpix deck. Um, so, does Alakazam... I think it does. It can attack from the bench, even though, you no, know, it doesn't even have an ability, so it can attack. So that's really good. Uh, they're not going to fill out the bench. I'll be very surprised if they do. If they fill out the bench, I'll be very happy. Um, Noivern's not going to be any good here. Arceus is not going to be very good here because we've got the advantage really here of. Right, that's a switch. Trinity charge. And that's going to be three for Alone and Vulpix. Yep, so they've got one energy in hand. Okay. We've got a Gear as well. And they've got a Greninja. So I am going to put that down. I'm actually going to evolve to this. And then do an Arvin. What am I doing? Uh, 30 for each 
So I'm doing 120, 150. Uh, what do I want? What do I want? What do I want? Uh, I want that. And... That Vulpix has got Shred, hasn't it? It's got Shred, so it's not going to be any good there. Um, I think the Ultra Ball would be better. Not for now, for next turn. So we can do one, 150, knock that out. Get that really close. Because um, uh, don't forget, Alone in Vulpix has Shred. Um, it's not affected when it attacks by your opponent's active Pokemon. So it is an official shred. It can get through. So yeah, you see here in a second. I'm going to get it up. So this attack, this attack isn't affected by any effects of your opponent's active Pokemon. So it's literally a shred. And it's 160, which is really good. Um, he's going to do his uh, star birth and find whatever he wants to find. Unfortunately, if I could have, if I could have, I would have um, put a Bidoof down. But I've prized both of them. What's the odds? 180. Okay. Okay. I need an energy. Give me an energy. No. Okay. I'm going to have to retreat. Into the mini queue. I can't really do much else there. Maybe I should have just gone into the Cleffer. And shut down this. But. Or should have gone into the Cleffer to shut down Starbirth. Maybe. I don't know. Okay. So the super did the Noivern and the Arceus and some energy. This is going to be a, a very interesting match. Let's put it that way. Uh, they can get past my Minikyu. We've got Greninja to draw, which is really interesting. Uh, which makes sense. If you play a load of energy, why not? Um, I don't see why not. I mean, start you know, Trinity Nova works well when there's energy in the deck, but if you use super rods and stuff like that, oh, that's well, that's not what I needed, was it? Oh, uh, okay, uh, I'm gonna have to pass, it's gonna have to be a pass. I can't do nothing, I ain't got the energy. I had to retreat. I should have maybe I should have got that switch. Done the switch, then I could have kept it, then I could have attacked, yeah, and saved the Ultra Ball. I was thinking I was going to need Alakazam, and then I'd drawn into Alakazam, and I was just like, oh, really? Shown's care, that's a really annoying thing. Okay, why would you go into that when you can't... Oh, you want to charge up another one? You could have gone into the Vulpix, by the way, but, all right. So they got rid of the mist energy. Energy Lotto. You looking for a double turbo, weren't you? Why did I have to bench lose both Bidoofs? Oh, can't believe. Oh dear. So when you when you it's the prizes, and they're gonna lose Ultra Ball and counter catch up which is really annoying um double turbo they can still attack it won't do any damage but they can still charge up the arceus so but i've got damage at alakazam at the minute but he can still charge up his arceus and he has no energy because he's been thrown him away oh my god really this is really bad at the minute. 
I'm in a bad situation. I've got so many supporters. On it's just the odds of you choosing two Badoofs. I mean, I could have TM evolutioned into a bower and then got what I needed, and I've still got nothing. I, just, I can't do nothing here. Now he'd have to retreat and use a Volpix, but I don't think that person's realised. Are oh, you kids? Really? That's really annoying. He's just top drawn into a boss's orders. So there goes an Anakazam, which puts us behind now. Okay. The mini cues are there. Serious. But it's no good to me, is it? Come on. Uh, uh. I think I might cut one Kleffa just to get Heavy Ball. Just for this actual occasion. Um, it might pay to have a Heavy Ball, to be honest. Because if I prized both Badoofs, which is my draw power as well. Oh, that's a... Yep, so Defiance Band is gone. Oh, uh, well. That would have increased the damage, so I could have two-shotted this Arceus, but okay. A judge. Okay, a judge. Judge is... Judge is good. Judge is good. Um, I'm going to go this and this. Find another Anakazam. Let's judge the Arceus team. And still no energy. Are you serious? All right. Okay. So we've got two energies there. Let's get this up here. And then stall them out. And then I'm going to use Eerie on them. And then hopefully I can draw into some energy or a capturing uh, Earthly Vessel. So that was a rare candy and a counter catcher. Uh, that's really unfortunate. Energy. No. Uh, let's have a look at the hand. Judge. That goes away. I'm going to energy recycle you and the two energies. All right. Still top drawing. They've got a judge. They're going to have to judge. I don't see him doing anything. Oh, no, they didn't judge. I was hoping for them to judge. Energy. Lovely. Pass. <laughs> it literally is stall. Who can top draw the best? If he pulls off a, re um, a research, it's really annoying. All right. Pass. <laughs> oh, my God. Where's all my energies? I've put all of them in. <gasps> oh, thank the stars. Right. 120. I can start attacking now. <sighs> I don't think they've realised they could attack with Vulpix, but it's one of them. A lot of people don't realise that that attack actually bypasses Miniku, Kefa, other effects and stuff like that. It, it's it's a really prime catcher. Right. Alakazam. Arceus. 180. How many bosses has he got? It's used one boss. It's going to have more than three. I did have a switch somewhere. Okay, so we've got an Eerie, we've got a boss, and we've got everything else. Uh, we're going to attach to you. Oh, no, I should have done... Got switches in the deck. Are you kidding me? Oh. <laughs>
<laughs> Why did I do that? I should have put it onto there. Fortune Sisters. And he's going to get rid of all my switches, isn't he? Wait a minute. What was that? Earthly Vessel? Of course it was. And a Super Rod. That's not good. I'm going to put it on you. There's the switch as well, by the way. Right. Let's see what's left in the deck. I've got Bosses, Eerie, and Iona. Right. Okay. I thought I had an Abra, but didn't I put it in? If I lost an Abra. Yeah, I've lost an Abra. Okay. Uh, I'll take the Ultra Ball. Don't need anything else, really. Um, and I'm just going to do this. And just keep doing that until they die. Arceus on there. Here we, it's going to be the switches. So I've lost a switch and an ultra ball. Awesome. All right, just keep attacking. If they top join to a boss, I don't know if I can win. I'd normally play about three bosses and one prime capture. Um, just so you get the full gust. Um, I am going to put the Jirachi down because that could actually help me. Yeah. Let's take two prizes here. Then we go to even prizes, which is really good for us. We might actually find the Bidoof, but I've probably... Cause I've, nope, we didn't. <laughs> it's got thing too because I've benched that Jirachi. It probably shouldn't have. Um... Okay. Yeah, see, shreds. I don't know why they didn't do that from the start. So I'm going to put the Jirachi up. So then we can get three rare, three can, uh, things we need. Okay. Let's... Yeah, I can still attack. Earthly Vessel. Uh... Okay, I do want to knock this out, so I'm going to have to, yes, put that there, keep the boss, they're literally hoping to top draw a boss, that is simple as that, I don't know if they've still got energy to throw away, I mean they weren't charging up the Arcuses, I don't understand, Right, then I get three prizes. So I get to have Eerie, that, and a boss. You get an extra prize. Awesome. Then I am going to promote the mini queue. Uh. And we do want to mess with the hands a little bit. I think maybe the Iona. Make them really go down because they haven't got a Padoof down, Pabal down. And I've got a boss again, so that's fine. Then I can do 120, knock that out. Take two prizes. I pay any money, it's Padoof. No! I'm. <laughs> Where's my Padoofs? Are you kidding me? I'll bet I've, t I'll bet I've I owned them into a boss. Toro. And it's going to be that. And then they're going to go into that. Which can actually take a hit as well. Which is really annoying. But we don't want that. We want to boss that up. 
Play Nick and Seed. <laughs> okay, I had, you have to play it in a certain way, like a stall deck, but it really does work. We'll go to the next match. Right, okay, so... Uh, not the most best hand, to be perfectly honest with you. Oh, that's a bit better. I want to keep it all of this, to be honest. Um, it is. It, uh, it's good against knock it stopping stuff, but I don't see it happening. Um, so I'm going to attach for you. Um, I don't see it. If you know what I mean, they'll just use the charm aliens and stuff like that i mean i could have done eerie but i want to keep the eye owner i would have liked sweet house as well um so it's arceus charizard okay this could be interesting i am charizard is one of our worst matchups to be honest because of weakness to alakazam he's weak to dark so even a charizard we've got all for all prizes it still doesn't matter Right, you, and then we're gonna Iona. I didn't want to Iona, but it's gonna have to be. It is what it is. Right. Right, should we take a prize? Another Abra. Then we're going to have to go Abra, attach. That gave them everything they need in their hands with that Iona. There's the Buddy Poffin, so they can get another Charmander and another Pidgey. So they're using Arcus V-Star, Padoof, Pidgeot, and Charizard. Why not? So they're using the Arceus over probably over Luminion. Maybe. I mean, it's all it worked in the past. Everyone did used to play Arceus, Charizard. Then the Pidgeot came. Um and then they added Pidgeot and then they took out the Arceus. Uh and now they started putting in Bidoof and Pidgeot. And now it looks like Arceus as well at the same time. So why not? There's rare candy. Charizard. And if they knock out the Jirachi, fine. Because that means I get three prizes. Uh, three choices out of my deck. And you know which one I'm going to choose? Minikyu. And I need to knock out this Pidgeot, to be honest with you. Then the Charizard. If I take out the Pidgeot, they, lo they lose their quick search to find bosses. And then it depends on... Star Birth and Babel. Mm. Also, have they got what they need? Oh, <gasps> they don't. Okay, that's really, really, really good for us. Really bad for them. Uh,. I really want to put it on here, but I'm going to put it on this. I'm going to take out this. Take out the Pidgeot. I don't want him having the Pidgeot. I really don't want him to have Pidgeot. <laughs> I really don't. Um, no, 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 no. No Pidgeots. No, no, no. No quick search boss to knock out Malakazam. That's the little. That's the only thing you really have to worry about. That and Prime Catcher, uh, and Counter Catcher's live as well at the minute as well, which is scary as well. Iona, so I'll go to four. I lose a load of energy, but right there's a Manaphy. I added. I finally added a Manaphy into the deck. Um, yeah, I added a Manaphy. Um, it, when you go against Chimpao. You really do need it. It protects your mini cues um, and the bench because they're really, you know, soft and squishy. 
uh, with 50 HP, 60, and everything else, 90. I mean, Jirachi's, if he's not in the active and it gets knocked out, he don't get to use its ability in Trusted Wishes. Um, it has to be in the active for it to work, which is why it works so well with Alakazam, because Alakazam can attack from the bench. Right, okay, so... He's used up a barrel, which is good. He's going to put in energies, yeah. I probably would have charged up the Arceus, but fine. And that's 240, fine. All right, I want you, you, I don't actually want to mess with the hand, so I could do it with boss. Yeah, I could find the mini cube with the ultra balls. Thank you. Right. I'm going to put you up front so I can retreat. You. You. Mini cube. Bosses orders this. Retreat this into this. Then do Babal for free. Awesome. Then I can attach to you. Then I can do Mind Jack. Knock out the other draw engine they have. And then, yeah, I thought they would. This is the, I think this is the only way you can really count that. So now they're going to find boss. Bellet's going to be a boss. Guarantee it's going to be a boss. That's why I wanted to make sure I had another Alakazam ready. It's going to be a boss. 100%. It's, it's got to be. Because you're going to have to boss up the Alakazam. We're going to keep taking prizes. It's a Roxanne. Interesting. I have Babao. Why would you Roxanne? I don't understand that. You could have bossed there. You could have used boss. Why Roxanne when you've got... I've got Babao. All right. I'll just judge you next turn then. Fuck. <laughs> Don't mind. As long as I win, I don't, I don't mind because it's just a really hard matchup against Charizard because of the weakness. Because uh, this is a dark type now, and we're weak to dark, you know, uh, times two. So Charizard, even if we, if they've taken no, I've taken no prizes, it can still one shot my Alakazam every single turn. We can do two forty. We're doing two hundred and ten. Uh, 210 at the minute because I've got four Pokemon on the bench. So if we do 120 to this, okay, and then do 210, we can knock it out. But we can only do that once. Um, I'm going to do uh, that and try and get another mini queue down. That's cool. Uh, I am going to do incisors first before I do a judge. Okay, got very candy that. Can I juice up a third? Probably can. There's only one energy in the discard, so I I can juice up for I could juice up three Alakazams. Oh, it's broken! It's broken! The judge, the special art judge, just broke the game. Come on, game. Don't break. I'm I'm so close. I'm so close. Right, I've got air eight. So we're gonna take out another Charmander. Right. That puts us we've only got to take two more prizes. An Arvin and that. Um let's see. I do need to find another energy though. I really don't want to Iona them. Um there goes that. 
They could two shot in a mini queue. Boss's orders. Alakazam. I knew it was going to come. Um, and there's Starbirth as well. I could actually Iona him now, actually, to be fair. I'm going to lose the Alakazam. But I have one almost charged up. Another one there. Can, as long as I keep promoting the mini queues, can do it. Ish. I could actually kill the. Oh, would that work? The Lamillion. Well, it's going to be promote. I don't know. So whatever they pulled, they've lost. Awesome. Raw. Four. I've lost some energy in that. So we need to put the energies back in. Need the energies. Okay. And I've got the cleft keys. We're going to do 120. And at the minute, this is doing... Uh, so, 180 at the minute. Soon 180. Uh, which is not enough to one-shot to one -shot this. If they bench another Pokemon, it'll be enough. But I have to get this Minikyu out and this Alakazam in the active... To do mind jack. So we can do the mind jack. For, so it does 30 for every bench Pokemon your opponent's got. Plus 90. So if they've got 5, it's 240. 4, it's 210. You know where I'm going with this. And 3 is 180. I need them to put another Pokemon down on the bench. Go on, go on. Oh, it's going to be another Charizard. There you go. Yeah. All right. So, did they do a super rod? They did. They probably put the energies back in. No. I would have put the energies back in to charge up the Arceus. Alright. Top drawing, by the way. So, messing with their uh, thingy bobs will mess them up. There's an Arvin and that. It's an Arvin. I'll use an Arvin. <laughs> and switch. Okay. I can't do it yet, though. But let's get some more damage on this Charizard. They're going to retreat next turn. So I put into an energy. Uh, yeah. I knew they were going to retreat. That's why I put the extra energies onto that Charizard. But we just need a gust. And I'm pretty sure we've got another gust in the deck. Oh no, we might not have. Okay, that's an energy. Uh... Oh. <laughs> if I keep my hand, I've won. Even if they don't bench another Pokemon, I've won. As long as I keep my hand benched another Pokemon benched another two so I could do mind jack as well so I could do mind jack or I could do de-evolution which one's more cool could do the de-evolution there's no then put a energy down 
it would be easier just to do the evolution so i think that i'll probably just do the job i only need to take two prizes the mini q uh, uh, oh. pop 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 there we go and that is how alakazam beats charles rdx it's not the best matchup because we get hit for weakness but you have to focus on their search abilities their supporter cards not the charizards the supporters so you need to go for the pidgeys the bowels everything right okay so we go to the next part see you then right so as you saw this big charles rdx it even though it's one of its worth matchups because it can hit for weakness but as long as you go for the pidgey arts or the pidgeys and the Babao and the draw engine the, literally all the support cards it shuts down eventually the charles arts um so that match went as, as well as it could do um against arceus it's not a bad matchup because we can knock out the Arceus's and stuff like that, and the Volpixes and stuff like that. There's some matches up that can be a bit bad. I've put in a Manaphy because when I will go against Shin Pao, the Greninja is real. So don't forget that. So please comment down below what you think. And also, yeah. And let me know what you think of this deck and everything else and what about the new cards coming out as well this in May. And yeah, catch you on the next one. See you.